Another alternate hand strike you want in your toolkit is the hammer fist. We're looking at keeping our fist strong, but we're not going to be punching or jabbing. So if I'm left leg forward guarding stance, kick! I want to think about coming in and hitting with the chop of my hand. So keeping my fist strong, my wrist strong, I would go to 11 and 1. I'd come through and I'd hit going in on this diagonal somewhere in the corner. So I'd be going into the neck, into the jaw, maybe into the temple. So I'm coming in hitting on a 1 o'clock and 11 o'clock type of striking. 1, 11. 1, 11. I could also go straight down on 12, but my target would be the bridge of the nose. It's a fairly small target, not that easy to hit. So we're looking for the bigger targets on the sides of the head. Next, 3 and 9, into the floating ribs. Coming here, I'm going to hit and drive in. Reach out. Don't be in tight. Your opponent's out far, so you have to reach out and hit like you're hitting the sides of a bass drum and extending towards your opponent. Last but not least, the 6 o'clock, coming into the groin. So where I'm going to be going is from the front hand, I'm going to be coming down slightly outside of my leg and then hitting up into the groin, the center line if I'm doing it to air. So I'm coming in and I'm hitting out in front of my groin and again, extending out so that you're reaching towards your opponent. Don't stay in here because you're not going to get to where you need to go with the strike. And those are the hammer fists.